Hi, Mark Gillen here. And we're going to have a wee look at averages. Right, that's going to get you through these. Right, let's have a wee look at averages. So the first thing we're going to have a wee look at is the different types of averages. And we'll go through. Mostly, most people tend to use mean and and uh, you'll see what I mean. Oh, pardon the pun. Right, so we're going to have a wee look at median. We'll have a wee look at mode. And there's the mean that we're speaking about. That's what most people tend to use on average. Sorry, I'll, I'll cut out the humour. Right, let's keep on going. So let's have a wee look at these uh, individually. So the median. You put all your numbers that you've got there that you want to find the average of. And you put them into numerical order, the lowest to highest. Whichever way you want to do it. And you pick the one in the middle. That's your median. The mode. Again, put them into numerical order. And take a wee look through that list, whichever way you're going to do it. Take a wee look through the list and it's whichever number appears the most. That's your mode average. The mean. This is the one that most people tend to actually have more knowledge at. And the mean is... Add all the numbers together, and then you divide by the number of numbers that you've got. The range. You take, again, you put them into order so you can see the lowest number that you've got and the highest number. And you subtract the lowest number away from the highest number. And that gives you range. So let's have a wee look. So an example, and then you can see what's happening here. So if we have these numbers here, we get five numbers, 44, 44, 67, 88, 180. Now it could be anything that could be uh, the results of a quiz or something. It could be anything at all that you've gathered these numbers. So let's have a look at the median so you understand the median there. So we've placed them into the order anyway. So they're already in numerical order from the lowest to the highest, 44 through to 180. And then they pick the one in the middle. Now it's quite handy because we've got an odd number. If you had an even number, it's a little bit more difficult, isn't it? Because then you could possibly get two numbers there in the middle. So it's just a very quick, median is very, very quick to say, there's going from there to there, and that's the one in the middle there. So 67, obviously. Right, with the mode, you place them in numerical order like we have done from the lowest to the highest, so 44 to 180. And you see which one crops up the most. So which one appears the most. So obviously when we're looking there, 44 appears twice. So therefore, 44 is your mode. Now we're going to have a look at the mean. Now the mean, like I said, is... You add all the numbers up, so your 44 plus 44 plus 67, 88, 108, comes to 423 in this instance. And it would be the same as what you do in any time. So you add all the numbers that you've got together. You then divide by the, the amount of numbers you've got. So we've got 1, 44, 44, that's 2, 67, 3, 88, 4, 180 is 5. Therefore, 423 divided by 5, and that gives us 84.6. Therefore, the mean average is 84.6. So if you look at the range, you subtract the lowest number away from the highest number. So in this instance, the highest number is 180. Take away the 44, which is the lowest, that gives us 136. So therefore, the range 136 in this instance. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Bye just now.